So I think it was about August or September last year, um, I saw on the CAN website this CAN uh, Chimera, Chimera, we think it is, um, saw this initiative, this competition, open to all creatives all around the globe. Um, and it really was, the brief was quite simple. It was use your creativity to solve um, a, a global issue, and that was um, poverty alleviation. Um, so we opened the brief up to all the creatives and we did what we call a Golden Friday, which is giving everyone time to work on a proactive idea. Um, and yeah, so this, the good sense, the idea that we we're going to take you through was one of the ideas that came from that. But I think the initiative is a joint partnership between CAN and the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation. Um, and it really is using the power of the creatives of the world to solve a global problem. Um, yeah, so it, it, the, the brief was really that simple, like what's a good creative idea to solve world poverty? Um, basically it stemmed from the insight that one in four people uses online banking and then another thing was that at the end of your bank balance you have um, a certain number of cents. Those cents are pretty useless to you, you can't really buy anything with them. So imagine we could create something that would um, channel those cents towards one global fund that would then be used to alleviate world poverty. And that's where the idea of Good Sense was born. We submitted a document explaining the idea in the most concise, uh, clever way that we could, pretty much. The idea, the, 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 the idea had to speak for itself. There was no supporting material to make the idea any better than it was. Basically, it was one, A4 page, one yeah. A4 page of an insight, a creative solution, and ways forward. We submitted the idea and, and then forgot about it. And in January, we... Yeah, we got the email and a phone call saying that we've been shortlisted. Well, actually they call it, they picked eight winners, so it wasn't even a shortlist, it was actually one of the eight winners. And then they asked for the team to come over and develop the idea even further. So at the end of March, Amy and Monique are off to Seattle, to the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, to go and develop the idea further with the team from that side and with I think it's last year's CAN Grand Prix, or sorry, CAN judges. If the idea gets chosen, um, we have a chance to go back in September to represent the idea that's been fully fleshed out and consolidated. And if the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation approves it, we get a million dollars to implement it worldwide. Yeah.